Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? Welcome to a brand new video. Today, what we're going to be doing is going over the week five drop list for Supreme Spring Summer 2020. Today is Wednesday, the 25th of March, as I'm recording this and as it's going up. Tomorrow, 26th, is the release. I'm going to be going over what's coming out, my opinions on all the, the items that are coming out, and yeah, we're just going to go through everything. So, hopefully, you guys are watching this before the actual release so you can know what's coming out. If you're not, turn on post notifications and next week, You'll be able to see it before the actual drop releases. All right, shameless plugs out the way. Let's get into the items. It's a sick week. Trust me, there's a lot of really nice, just like personal pieces. So let's just get into it. So first off, the item that broke the internet, it literally is the most hyped item of the season, which is ridiculous. This Supreme Oreo comes in a three pack. And yeah, man, it, what, what can you say? It's a Supreme Oreo, it's ridiculous. <laughs> So by broke the internet, I mean it literally, it reached mainstream medias because it was going crazy on eBay. There was a bunch of like fake sales running it up. Um, people were like, oh, this Supreme Oreo is selling for like 10 grand, but it hadn't even released. So it was like people that didn't know Supreme were trying to know Supreme, but didn't. And yeah, it just didn't work. But anyway, it's, it's heavily hyped and it is releasing this week. Packs of three and apparently it's $8 for a pack of three, which is like a crazy price. That's so expensive. Um, but I think the resale is going to be crazy, so if you do want to pick up a pack or a few just to sell, you honestly might as well. Um, apparently you can pick up multiples, so I don't know if that means you can pick up like one, two, three, four up to a maximum, or if you can get as many as you want, but you can get multiple packs of the Supreme Oreo this week. <laughs> it's crazy. Not sure how limited it's going to be or how quickly it's going to sell out, but I'm definitely going to be going for this just for... I want a pack and I would also resell a pack, so we'll just see. Now I'm going to go over the collab for this week and the collab this week is Timberland and there's actually a really, really nice piece that's come out of this collaboration, so let's get into that real quick. So the best piece out of the collaboration is the crew neck, 100%. It comes in four different colorways. It's like, I don't know if it's a black or a navy and then it's an olive red and there's like a tan, off-white, creamy kind of color and that is by far the best one. I'm just going to go over the tan one because that's the one I'm going to try and cop. It's so, so nice, so clean. All embroidered text, which is crazy. And you, you know with Timberland, like the quality is going to be really, really good because it's like outdoor wear. And just the, the materials and all that good stuff is going to be really good quality. Now, this has been really well received by the community and it's probably going to be the hardest item to get of the week. And that's because I don't know how limited the Oreo is going to be. I feel like they're not going to be particularly limited. So this is probably going to be pretty hard to get. But... A really, really nice piece and probably the best piece of the week. Um, definitely worth a cop if you do have the money for it. So yeah, I'm going to be going for this in my size. It's going to sell out real quick, so hopefully I can get it, but we'll see. Now something coming out of the collab that is not good at all is the shoe. The shoe is so ugly. And it is the Supreme Timberland Patent Leather Euro Hiker Low. It is awful. It is so bad. I don't know what they were thinking. It's like a low hiking shoe with a patent leather all over upper. It's awful. Yeah. I don't know why anyone would buy it, but I'm sure people will just because it's Supreme. Uh, yeah, it's not gonna sell out. I can tell you that much. It's not gonna sell out straight away anyway. It might sell out eventually just because it's Supreme and it will sell, but this is not gonna be hard to get. If you do like it, fair enough, you'll, you'll be able to get it very easily, but it, it's not it for me. It, this is tragic. And then the final piece of the collab coming out is this Supreme Timberland six panel. It's basically the same logo as the crew neck and it is embroidered. It's a really nice hat. I don't wear hats, so it's not really interested in me, but it does look really nice. So if you do wear hats, it's something you're into, that's there. Okay, collabs are most hype piece out the way. I'm going to go over a few nice things that are coming out this week that I actually really, really like. First up, we've got this Meta logo long sleeve top and it is really nice to be fair. I'm pretty sure it's embroidered all over and if it is, that is going to be absolutely crazy. I think the logo is sick. It's basically just like loads of words written out Supreme to make the word Supreme. And if it is all embroidered, that that is going to be really, really nice. It's going to remind me of that City tea, the City Lights tea. I have it, actually. This t-shirt right here, all over embroidered. And man, I, I love embroidered stuff. So I think this is a massively underrated piece for the week. I like this navy kind of greeny blue color and I like the white color. Um, I think they're really, really nice. And yeah, it, it's just a super underrated. I haven't seen much about it on the internet, but I think that is gonna be really nice. Retail might be quite high just because it is embroidered. It could be like 
78 pound or something like that for a long sleeve t-shirt but it's cool next up we got the signature spring summer top and it's basically just a bunch of basics with the word supreme written on in a signature kind of scribble style i'm sure it's going to be really good quality because it is a a top it's not a t-shirt but that means the retail is going to be crazy the retail is going to be like 68 pound on this i don't know about dollars um it's going to be a really good quality t-shirt because the tops are always really good um it's, it definitely is way better than the t-shirts but i don't know it's going to be an expensive retail it's embroidered on the logo which again it's a really big deal for me i love it um and i would definitely buy loads of these if i could i would buy like every color 100 percent if i had the money but probably not going to pick it up is a nice piece if you have the money go for it um i like this pink and then the white and the black will both be really nice as well but yeah not picking it up for me but it is a nice piece and then the final thing i want to go over in detail is the bling hooded sweatshirt this is sick like i think this is such a cool uh cord and then there's the shorts as well which is actually i think they're both really really cool however i feel like you have to be a certain type of person to wear this like this would suit like the influences the the celebrities, the the LA people that are, are wearing hoodies and shorts and like coordinated fits and that, but I think it's sick. Not something I would wear personally, but I, I think that would be such like a, a cool outfit to wear if you are that kind of person. Um, but if you want to wear just outlandish clothes, then go ahead, of course, no, no, no reason not to, but yeah, th this is like a, a really, really cool just pattern all over, scream supreme at you. And uh, yeah, you're definitely going to stand out wearing this. So if you want to go ahead and grab that, obviously go ahead. Unfortunately, I'm not an influencer, not a celebrity, not from LA, but uh, maybe one day. We'll see. Not going to be picking up for now, eventually. I'm imagine like five years down the line, I get this, that'd be crazy. But yeah, that, it's a really cool piece. Now I'm just going to go over everything that is dropping this week that I don't particularly care about, that I don't think is that significant, but you might like it, so... Shouldn't go over all of them. So first up, we've got this back logo sweater, which is just like an all over knitted crew neck sweater. Don't really wear knitted stuff. If this was a, like a heavy cotton sweater, I think it'd be cooler, but it's a knitted sweater. It comes out in a bunch of colorways and it's, uh, yeah, not it for me. You might like it. Then there's this velour tracksuit, which is actually quite nice. I can't lie. Um, again, I'm not gonna be wearing a velour tracksuit. It's that kind of like cartel mafia kind of vibe. Um, and then there's a matching track pant as well, if you like that, it's releasing this week. The woven hooded jacket is releasing this week. Quite a nice detail, it says Supreme down the sides here. Some kind of like indie hipster person could definitely rock this and I think it would be quite cool. Um, not for me, but it's releasing this week. The business hockey jersey, Supreme, never personal on the back. Business across the front, 1994, obviously when Supreme released. It's coming out this week. This is tragic. Don't buy this, I'm telling you. Even if you like it, don't do it. Don't do it to yourself. <laughs> Again, don't do it to yourself. What is good? Don't do it. Don't buy it. Pleated trouser. Don't do it. This is quite nice, I can't lie, but the price of Supreme shirts is ridiculous. This would be like $118 retail, which is mad. I like the black one, I would definitely wear that. I was actually quite sick. But yeah, those shirts are releasing this week. Not going to be buying them, but they are really, really nice to be fair. Can't. Can't knock it, I would definitely wear those, but not for the price that they retail them at. Rumors are also saying potentially Air Force One's restocking this week, but I feel like that is gonna happen every single week, so I, I wouldn't read too much into it. I'm sure one week you'll be able to get it if you do want it. That's what I'm kind of banking on, so. Another thing to mention this week is anything over $150 is gonna be free shipping this week. Um, obviously because of the whole situation, no one can leave their house. People can't go to the store, they're offering that kind of alternative. Um, I mean, it's, it's good. It's good of them to do that, but 150, just do it free. But not going to moan too much, at least they're doing that. All right, and that's going to do it for everything that's coming out this week. I'm going to be going for the Oreos, the Timberland crew neck, and potentially that Meta logo t shirt. Uh, let me know what you're going to go for in the comments below, or let me know if you did pick anything up. Comments below, appreciate it. Other than that, guys, make sure you subscribe. I'm going to be doing a live cop tomorrow of hopefully getting these things, and then obviously next week I'll be, I'll be saying what's coming out next week. So. If you guys want to see that, make sure to subscribe to the channel, turn on post notifications. Because otherwise you will not see the video. Subscriptions are broken. Turn on post notifications. Like this one if you did enjoy it. Other than that, thank you so much for being here. As always, I'll see you in the next one.